Yeah, we're going to have thousands of flags here on Art Hill in Forest Park. We can show you this happening right now and also have the opportunity to join the uh, co-founder of this Flags of Valor event with us, Rick Randall. Thanks for joining us live. Uh, explain to people what this is all about. Well, we're going to be, uh, this morning we've already got a good start. We're putting up uh, 7,582 flags. They, they represent all the first responders that died on 9-11 trying to save lives in those buildings. Uh, and then the 7,054 uh, young men and women that went overseas and never came home fighting those wars on terror to make sure 9-11 never happened again. We have about 600 volunteers out here right now doing this job. In addition to the flags, uh, each one has a photo and a special dog tag, correct? Yes. Uh, once we get all the flags up, uh, we have 25 flag teams with 300 flags each, and they'll be uh, putting on white gloves and doing the very personal job of putting dog tags and pictures on these flags in a, in a very specific order on the hill uh, so people can find their loved ones. And you have families who come from all over the country uh, to, to see their loved ones and see this display, of, correct? Yes, we do. Um, uh, Gold Star families really only uh, fear is that their loved ones, their heroes, will be forgotten. And uh, so we let them know that they're not forgotten and they appreciate it. They do come from, uh, from all over the Midwest, in fact, many, many other states uh, further than that, uh, to see their heroes flag and to, to see this display. And St. Louis will show them that St. Louis uh, will never forget their kids. Thank you, Rick. I know you're busy as you oversee this and, and have these volunteers that put those flags in place. Again, they will be on display through September 12th. You can come here to Forest Park. They'll be up. They're putting them up right now. Reporting live from Art Hill, Jeff Bernthal, Fox 2 News.